Having a guest on your live stream is a great way to grow your audience. But what if you could go directly, go live directly on their channel as well? Well, now you can thanks to Restream Pairs. Let's take a look. Hello and welcome to the channel. My name is Nick Paul Kuski, and today we're going to talk all about Restream Pairs, and it's, which is a really cool new feature from Restream, um, a service that allows you to go to broadcast to multiple different platforms at the exact same time. And Restream Pairs really allows you to allows you to go live on somebody else's channel without having to get any sort of login information or anything else like that. Uh, you just send them a link and then they're able to connect it so that you can go live directly on their channel. And this is super valuable because it allows you to grow your channel, grow your audience um, by reaching out to these other people, these other locations, and they get familiar with you at the exact same time. And it helps uh, just smooth things along. I've used it here uh, the past few weeks um, for a few different things, mainly for fundraising type of events where we want to, where there's a, um, somebody partnering with this organization and we want to go live in several different locations with both on the main organization's uh, YouTube channel but as well as some of the partner channels uh, we can broadcast simultaneously the exact same feed no adjusting no anything like that it can go directly out to those channels so we're able to reach even a wider audience than we would have if we were only going live on that organization's channel works really well I'm really excited about it and I think it's something you're going to want to check out as well so let's jump in and talk just exactly how this works first this is going to allow you to go live on another person's or another organization's Facebook uh, YouTube uh, really anywhere that restream is supported you're gonna be able to go live on those other channels um, of somebody else and again like I mentioned it allows you to go live without having to set everything up get all their login information make sure you have the correct access to their account things like that so it's much more secure and it means because people aren't sharing their passwords or their account information or even having to grant you access to their, their account you only get access if they approve it if they said it said your your live stream can go live using that the the link that you provide i think people are going to be much more willing to allow you to go live on their channel or their, on their page because of that security factor that they don't have to share passwords it's just super simple super easy to click that and they retain full control without giving away uh, any piece of it just because i know there's lots of organizations lots of people who are hesitant to do that as someone who does a lot of producing there's times where they don't even necessarily want to give me full access to their channel just because they're a little protective of it completely understand um, so we just have to always make sure that somebody is in the room that has access to us but the fact that we have something like this this is going to allow more people to uh, work with others and collaborate even more than before which is really a reason that i really love this restream pairs all right so let's take a look to see how restream pairs works first what's going to happen is that you're going to jump in and set Create your stream just like you would for any other uh, live stream event. You're most likely gonna wanna be a scheduled stream. So you're just gonna go ahead and create that and then tap that little edit button once you have it created and tap paired channels. And then you can grab that URL right there and then just send that URL out to whoever you want to whoever you're inviting to connect and do that stream. They're gonna get a little invite. They're gonna tap the pair your channels and so you can send that link URL out, you know, by email, you can text it, you can do a f Facebook message, anything, any way you want to get them that link. And then all they have to do is they're going to tap on that link. It's going to take them to a URL page like this where it shows your stream and then ask them to pair your channels together. And you, they just click pair channels. And then they're going to be asked to create a restream account. So if they're already a restream member they can, or a user, they'll be able to use their account. Otherwise, they can create a brand new account. This is going to be completely free. Um, they don't need to subscribe or anything like that. They just create that account. And then um, they can add which channels they want to connect. Do they want to connect Facebook, YouTube, uh, Twitch? And then, again, it works with any other one that uh, restream has. So if they're adding the YouTube channel, you're just going to click that, hit connect, and then you're going to sign in to your YouTube channel there, just like you normally would, and then just connect whichever channel you want to connect, and be sure to allow uh, all those settings, and you are good to go, and you are ready to start streaming directly there. And of course, a couple things to keep in mind, they do have to have live stream enabled. Um, so if they haven't done that yet, they should do that, and then you have to generally wait 24 hours in order to enable that. 
And you see, once the, you're in there, you can actually jump in to create a new event or use one of the other ones that are created. Um, you can independently turn on and off any of the streams that you have. So say they connected multiple things or multiple YouTube channels or multiple uh, Facebooks. So you can turn those on and off um, however you'd like. And then all you have to do is hit save and then it's all set and ready to go. And you can start live streaming to that channel. It's really cool, really smooth process. A um, couple things to also note is that you are able to fully edit. Uh, as someone who is pairing another stream to your channel, you're able to fully edit that description, that title. Um, you can edit the thumbnail as well. So you do have a lot of flexibility there in terms of the, the way you, the event looks. It can be branded, it have your URLs, things like that. So it's, I um, really love that fact too, that you don't have to just take exactly what whoever is streaming it, use their exact same description, all that. Um, so that's a nice, fun feature. And I just wanted to take a second to thank this video sponsor, which is Restream. So we've been talking about Restream this entire video, um, specifically one of the features they have, but they have tons of other features uh, that make this a really awesome product and a really great product for anybody who's looking to grow their live streaming audience. Even if you're just starting out, you can use something like their Restream Studio in order to create a very professional, high quality live stream uh, and stream that, that stream to multiple different channels. I do love their multi-streaming. That's probably the piece that I use personally the most is their multi-streaming and now using some of these extra little features that they have like Restream pairs. Um, so go be sure to check out Restream by heading over to nickpolkuski.com slash Restream. You can learn more and sign up using that link. And if you wanna learn even more about Restream, be sure to check out this playlist right here. I have several different videos on Restream because I think it is an amazing service that can help you grow your live streaming audience.